people say that we breathe in oxygen and exhale out carbon dioxide. Now, I have always wondered how come my body is changing this oxygen to carbon dioxide and I don't even know of it? If you have ever wondered the same thing, then come on, today let's clear our doubts. You see, our lungs are the only organs that actually exchange gases. The lungs have alveoli or the air sacs in them. These alveoli are almost one cell thick and surrounding these alveoli or the air sacs are blood capillaries which are also one cell thick. Blood which is dark red in color and rich in carbon dioxide comes from the heart and flows into these blood capillaries. When you inhale, you take in oxygen which goes into these alveoli or air sacs. This oxygen gets diffused into the blood which is in the blood capillaries and the carbon dioxide from that blood passes from the capillaries and into the alveoli. And then when you exhale, you give out that carbon dioxide. The bright red blood which is now rich in oxygen is taken to the heart by these capillaries. The heart then pumps this blood to the rest of the organs of your body. Now, have you ever wondered how is this oxygen picked up by the blood? What is present in the blood that is so special? Well, you see how chlorophyll captures the energy from sunlight. Similarly, we have hemoglobin which captures oxygen. Hemoglobin is a protein which is made up of iron and is present in the red blood cells. And hemoglobin loves oxygen. It combines with oxygen to form oxyhemoglobin which is Hb plus O2 gives HbO2. Now, oxyhemoglobin can also split and give us hemoglobin and oxygen. Now, hemoglobin loves oxygen so much that if it is exposed to air at sea level, almost every molecule of hemoglobin will combine with oxygen to form oxyhemoglobin. So what have we learned today? We have learned how the gaseous exchange happens from the alveoli to the capillaries. Until next time, happy learning!